Hi there, and welcome to the It's a Wonderful Life episode of Where It Was Made. Of course, you all know the classic story of myself, George Bailey, and, and Clarence the Angel. Uh, if not, I, I'm not really sure why you're watching a video about the production of it, but that's none of my business. Well, here we see Bedford Falls. It's our snowy little town and home to me, George Bailey. A lot of folks say that the town was based on Seneca Falls in New York. However, this snowy holiday classic was actually shot entirely here in sunny Los Angeles, California. And that snow that you see was actually achieved by fomite, soap, and a wind machine. As a matter of fact, this whole picture was shot in the middle of a heat wave. Movie magic, folks. Oh, well, what do you say? L let's go pay a visit to the location from our movie that remained today. Oh, would you look at that? Here we see the house of our old friend, Mr. Martini, built right here in Bailey Park. Uh, there's the porch where me and Mary welcome the family to their new home with bread and wine and salt. Bread, that this house may never know hunger. <laughs> oh, and over here's where the entrance to Bailey Park was. Now, now, actually, this was in Flint Ridge, California. It was a town that was newly developed in 1946, which made it perfect for our little picture, and I bet you Mr. Potter would have loved to get his hands on that. Well, now we see a, a very famous gymnasium that's actually also a swimming pool. Now, the, the scene in the movie is a school dance. Uh, I go back to see my younger brother Harry and, and all my old friends, and, and I, that's the night I met Mary. And, uh, well, we start dancing, we're doing the Charleston, and, and we're not paying attention, but everybody uh, looks to see that the floor has opened up. And uh, there's a swimming pool underneath, and, and we're, we're dancing, and we fall right in, and everybody jumps in after us. And uh, what's really remarkable is that that's a real, uh, real gymnasium effect. It wasn't for the movie. And Beverly Hills High School, uh, where this scene was filmed, actually has what they call a swim gym, and it's oh, it's open to this day. Well, of course, you're probably wondering, well, what about the famous streets of Bedford Falls itself? Well, as crazy as this sounds, the entire town was built on a set on the old RKO Ranch in lovely Encino, California. Now, this is hard to believe that such a fine-looking town in upstate New York was made up of plywood and you could pick up all the bits of Bedford Falls at the hardware store. The former Bedford Falls is now actually bordered by the 101 freeway in Lake Balboa. On the site of our town now sits a sports park, uh, uh, apartment buildings, and housing. Well, uh, the famous Main Street ran along what is now Ostrom Ave. However, the trees from the RKO Ranch that were scattered throughout the set were left behind to grow and, and are actually the only things still there these 68 years later. And the moon is still there, of course. That's still in the sky. What is it you want, Mary? What do you want? You, you want the moon? Just say the word and I'll throw a lasso around it and pull it down. Now, to this day, it's, it's one of the longest sets built for an American movie. It covers about four acres. It includes 75 stores and buildings a main street, a, a building and loan, a, a bowling alley, a movie house, a, a factory district, and a large residential slum area. Now the, now the main street was about 300 yards long, and that covers about three city blocks. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas George! Merry Christmas, movie house! Merry Christmas, Emporium! 
well, uh, as much as we wanted to return there to recreate this classic scene, you know, I suppose that this will just have to do. A Merry Christmas, Hollywood sign! Well, that just about does it for this episode. Thank you for watching, everyone. Merry Christmas and happy holidays from your friends at Small Town Pictures and from me, George Bailey, in Bedford Falls, New York. And subscribe, will ya? It's a wonderful channel!